Hey third grade, welcome to social studies class. Hope you're feeling good on a Friday just like I am and are ready for the weekend. Uh, today, we are going to move up the food chain from local government and city and county and talk about states. Uh, first of all, I really love how you guys have been showing what you know in Google Classroom assignments, and I've been looking at your answers, and I'm giving you feedback, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna be sending those assignments back to you guys soon. So keep up the good work. Um, I can tell you guys are learning a lot, and so am I. So I've been doing a lot of teaching for the past week, and you guys have seen a lot of my face and seen a lot of my videos. Today, I want you guys to teach yourselves a little bit. So what I'm going to do is set up a scavenger hunt to learn all about the state that we live in. Does anyone know what state we live in? We know we live in Syracuse, and that's our city. We know we live in Onondaga County, that's our county. Think about it. New York State? If you said that, that's a pretty good guess, you're right. So we're going to learn about New York State government a little bit of our state history and what makes our state so special. Hey friends, hope you're ready to start the scavenger hunt with me. Um, for this scavenger hunt, you have two different options. Your first option is to do it online alongside me and I'll show you exactly what website to go to and how to find your answers. Um, I've got an assignment in your Google Classroom that has eight questions that I want you guys to find. Um, and some of them are going to be really easy and some of them might be a little tricky so you have to look around to find them. Um, I believe that you guys can do this though. Your second option is if you don't have access to a computer or you share one with someone else or you usually use your phone to watch YouTube videos, another option is you can ask an adult at home, a grandmother, grandfather, one of your parents, um, whoever's taking care of you while you're on break, and they're probably going to know the answer so you can go around and ask them and they can help you. Um, if you're doing it online, it's also a good idea to do that with an adult too. So they can help you get there and uh, make sure you can find the website. But right now, I'll show you where we're going. It's to Kids Feed, and it's kids with a Z. That's not the real spelling, but that's the way this website is spelling it. Kidsfeed.com, and then press Enter. Then you get to a page that should look just like this. If you use Google search too and you type in kidsfeed.com, it should be the top link that shows up in the search. Um, the next thing we're going to do is go to all topics here. And this is the trickiest part of all, so pay attention. We have to scroll all the way down. And if you notice, the topics are in alphabetical order. So all the A's are here, and then it goes to B's. You've got Barack Obama, Benjamin Franklin, Black Spider Monkeys. Then you have C's, California Facts, um, Emperor Penguins, E, F. And we're looking for New York, so we've got to go all the way down to the ends. And guess what? We found it. You should see a picture of the New York State flag there and that's how you know you're in the right spot. If you guys want to do some exploring after you're done with the scavenger hunt, this website is awesome if you're curious about basically anything. And wow, my internet's slow. I hope yours is a little faster. Um, so then you get to a page that says New York Facts for Kids. Learn all about New York State. This is the best website for kids that I could find. Um, and it has so many different sections to tell you so many different things about the states. There are 38 sections in the table of contents, which is awesome. Um, you guys are very good readers. So if you use the table of contents and I ask a question, for example, about New York State food facts, then you can use your good reading skills to try to find where New York State food facts is and in this case it's number 24. You would click on that and then look, it shows you all of the different kinds of food that are typical in New York State, which would be awesome. I'm not gonna ask you about that, but 
this way you'll know how to navigate things a little bit. Uh, so start having a look around um, and go to Google Classroom and uh, check out the questions and see if you guys can complete all eight. I bet you can get 100. Show me that I'm right uh, and have fun. After the video, um, I found a wonderful song about the 50 states with all of the state capitals. It's really catchy. It gets me pumped up every time. So have a listen to that and then go back and do your scavenger hunt. Um, I hope you guys have an awesome Friday and I'm looking forward to seeing all of your responses and how much you can teach me about our great state of New York. Um, I will see you guys Monday. Have an awesome Friday. Bye-bye. We're the United States of America, we're 50 strong and proud. Here's the names of all our states and their capitals sing loud. My name is Alabama, my capital's Montgomery. Welcome to Alaska, Juno's a great place to see. I am Arizona, my capital is Phoenix. My name's Arkansas, my little rock is so scenic. I'm California, dude. Sacramento's my capital. Come to Colorado, visit Denver if you go. I'm Connecticut, my capital is Hadford. Welcome to Delaware, visit Dover if you're bored. My name is Florida, Tallahassee's a place to be. I am Georgia, Atlanta's a great city. Aloha, I'm Hawaii. Come to Idaho, visit Boise when you go. We're the United States of America, we're 50 strong and proud. Here's the names of all our states and their capitals sing loud. Welcome to Illinois, Springfield is the place to see. If you visit Indiana, Indianapolis is in me. I am Iowa, Des Moines is my capital. And if Kansas, Topeka has it all. Welcome to Kentucky. Frankfurt is a nice city. Down here in Louisiana, Baton Rouge is real pretty. Up here in Maine, Augusta is really nice. Here in Maryland, Annapolis is worth its price. Visit Massachusetts, Boston's a little bean. Up here in Michigan, Lansing is worth the see. Hey, it's Minnesota, St. Paul's our capital. But down in Mississippi, Jackson is the place to roll. We're the United States of America, we're 50 strong and proud. Here's the names of all our states and their capitals sing loud. Hi there, I'm Missouri, Jefferson City's really cool. But up here in Montana, Hill ain't You should stop by Lincoln City In Nevada, Carson City Is the one we think is pretty New Hampshire welcomes you Visit Concord anytime If you stop by New Jersey Trenton is quite a find I am New Mexico My capital, Santa Fe New York's the Empire State Albany's where you can stay Here in North Carolina You can see Raleigh my name is North Dakota, Bismarck is so fine. Ohio is my name and Columbus is all mine. I am Oklahoma, Oklahoma City, you unwind. We're the United States of America, we're 50 strong and proud. Here's the names of all our states and their capitals sing loud. In the great state of Oregon and Salem, you can trust Pennsylvania. When you're in Rhode Island, Providence is where you should go. I am South Carolina, Columbia is what I know. Up here in South Dakota, Pierre is a heck of a town. When you're in Tennessee, Nashville won't make you frown. Texas is my name, Austin's known for its great music. Utah's really great, Salt Lake City is amusing. Up here in Virginia is a state that has Richmond on its arm. I'm Washington, Olympia 
is my capital. In West Virginia, Charleston will make your belly full. Wisconsin is the cheese, and Madison's really.